Good morning from National Weather Service Pocatello. This is your weather hazard briefing for Monday, July 18th. Our key points for today, we are gonna have strong winds across the region and we do have wind and lake wind advisories out through 8 p.m. We do have critical fire concerns. Uh, we do have a red flag warning in effect today as well. We do have slightly cooler temperatures today but starting tomorrow, we're going to be drying out even more, and we will have um, some warming up as high pressure returns to the region. And come end of week, we will have some very slight chances of thunderstorms returning. Our weather risk outlook for the next several days. Again, today for the Snake Plain, Magic Valley, Lost River area, and Lemhi County, we do have that red flag warning out. It's going to be very windy, and we have very low humidity levels. Across the south winds, less of a concern, but it will be breezy there. And across the eastern and southeastern highlands, we do have chances for scattered thunderstorms, and it will be breezy as well. And along the Wood River area, those low humidity levels as well, and windy there as well as the Sawtooth area. And beginning tomorrow, we will have that high pressure returning, so we'll be warming up even more. And we will be breezy over the next several days, and those humidity levels will continue to drop. So that will continue to be a concern. It just won't be as windy. And come end of week, we do have very slight chances for thunderstorms, mostly confined to just the highlands at this time. Here's a current look at satellite imagery. We do have a low pressure system set up right now over Washington, and it will be moving through the Panhandle, the Idaho Panhandle today. And that's where we're going to see those uh, winds coming from, that tight pressure gradient. And you can see here this ridge that's over our region. It's currently shifting east out of the region. Um, so those clouds are moving, moving there with it. These um, upper level scattered clouds are moving to the northeast. Our fire weather outlook, as you can see, SPC has us in um, elevated but also critical um, fire concerns. Again, these are our advisories that are out today through the end of the evening. We do have the red flag warning for the Snake River Plain, Magic Valley, Lost River area, and Lemhi region. We have a wind advisory for the Upper Snake, Lemhi region, and Arco Desert areas. And also you can see just here underneath the other one, the lake wind advisory for American Falls Reservoir. High temperatures today, uh, generally we're going to be in the upper 80s to mid 90s across the Snake Plain in our southern regions and elsewhere we're going to be in the upper 70s to 80s. Strong wind gusts today um, and sustained winds as well. We're looking at potentially reaching a 50 mile per hour gust across much of the region um, and sustained strong winds as well. And that combined with our low humidity levels creates for um, very high fire weather concerns. You can see here a lot of the area is in that 10 to 15 percent um, minimum humidity level. Temperatures for Tuesday are low temps. Uh, we're looking at 50 degrees and above for the Snake Plain and regions further south and below 50 degrees for our higher elevations further north. And highs for tomorrow, we're going to be slightly warmer than today, several degree increase as high pressure returns. And tomorrow it'll also be breezy, um, definitely nothing like we're looking at today, uh, but we will have a little bit of breezy winds and we'll be even drier. And just to summarize, we do have very strong winds expected today through much of the region, and we do have the wind and lake wind advisories out through 8 p.m. We are under critical fire weather concerns, and we do have a red flag warning out considering our low humidity levels and the strong winds today. And with that system moving through, we are going to be slightly cooler. And beginning tomorrow, we're going to be drier and warming up uh, for the next several days. And come Friday, we are looking at potentially slight chances uh, for thunderstorms returning to the Highlands region. Thank you so much for listening. If you have any questions or concerns, please don't hesitate to email or call us or check us out on weather.gov. Hope you have a wonderful and safe day.